Mental health and youth violence are huge issues for young people in London. We talk about groups of people being hard to reach and what we're trying to say is well actually the services are hard to reach so let's try and change the way the services and systems are set up to make them more accessible. We work alongside young people in their communities because we believe they've got the solutions to these issues. If you're from a marginalised background, that environment you come from becomes your picture. Just because I come from Tottenham, I have to be someone you have to be cautious of. Whereas here at Mac, they don't see that. They just see it as your young person that's bringing your experience to the table, which you can then use to create solutions. Collaboration is in everything we do at Mac UK and actually we learn as much from our partner organisations as we hope they learn from us and that's really important. Our partnership with Mac has helped us scaffold a relationship with the local authority to enable systems change that goes much wider than just the conversations that we're able to have with young people. For young people from communities who haven't had good experiences of trying to get help, I think we are having an impact and we will continue to have an impact on lots of young Londoners. I see it happen here. The impact, the feedback, the reflection lets me know that it works, what we're doing. And that's why I'm so passionate about working here. Children's Trust supports young people who are facing multiple challenges. We primarily do that through our social enterprise restaurant, Waterhouse. A lot of the young adults that come here might have been involved in knife crime, gangs, or, or maybe even just have learning difficulties or a learning impairment. And the idea is to underpin that chef training with other areas of support. It's about giving them the sort of necessary tools to be able to be more independent and stand on their own two feet. Collaboration with other organisations is very important, but the collaboration with the client, we think that is equally as important. And understand what is it that is affecting you right now. How would you like us to support you with that? In my area, there is like violence, like gang violence. Before I did come here, I, I could have slipped into it. I was suffering from like depression, anxiety. First week, I didn't speak to anyone. I'm in this kitchen, it's like here. Yeah. I can't stop smiling. When he first came on the program, he was reluctant to even have hold conversations with people. For him to go from that to talking about some of the issues that he faced when he came on the program, I think that's that's humongous. I want to see that energy, guys. Let's get this teriyaki salmon working. Yes, chef. It just gives them that security that maybe wasn't there before they came to that program. We need programs like this that show them that it does work and there is an outcome that is beneficial to them. Street Doctors teaches life-saving skills to young people at risk of youth violence. We do that through a range of delivery partners and that teaching is done by young healthcare students who volunteer their time to teach those emergency first aid skills. Last year we worked with 320 delivery partners. Without them we wouldn't exist. Street Doctors are an amazing team of people who have very similar values and we really like that. We've been working with them for three years and every year we build on the work we do with young people and this is just an example of that carrying on. I'm going to count down from three, two, one and then I'm going to jump on straight away. There's no other charity that teaches the practical side but also opens up conversation about youth violence and together that's what creates change. There have been lots of recorded cases where the sessions that we've taught have been used by the young people and it has saved lives. I've had an amazing experience, you know, I've learnt skills that I didn't know before which I can use in the future. The fact that the young people we've taught have gone on to save lives is a incredibly moving thing. It's those young people who are often written off. They're the ones who become empowered to save the lives and that's what makes us especially proud of our work.